Hey guys, I wanted to do a video today on if your Honda 2200i can run a 15,000 BTU RV air conditioning unit. This is our 2019 Grand Design Imagine 2400BH. It's perfect for our family. And we do a lot of boondocking at our family property and we bought this Honda 2200i last year. It's been great. Run rec gas in it exclusively, change the oil. It's been perfect. Um, really like the um, the My Generator app that Honda has. You can use it to shut it off remotely from the app. It also tracks your um, service, so you, it tells you when you need to change the oil. Uh, shows how many hours are on the unit. So let's start it up, and I'll show you it running the air conditioning on our camper. Let's start it up here. I always flip the breaker first and then I turn it on once the generator is running you hear the beep so now the inverter on the camper is working so let's come over here okay so you can see we've got we've got the app up it's showing the generator running got about a hundred hours on this 106 engine hours all right we're gonna show this first going on cool low and we're gonna see what the generator does. So you can hear it kick on. Whoa. Showing it at about 1600. All right, let's, let's let it run. Let's see if this air is cool. Pretty cool. So kicked on on low cool just fine and we're gonna see what happens. We'll let it cool down for a little bit more and then we'll see what happens when we go to the cool high setting. See if it can handle it. And I am running the generator on non-eco mode. If you have it on eco mode then it'll probably want to trip and not have sufficient power. So make sure you're running it with eco mode off. I can definitely feel it. Mm. So cool. Uh -huh. mm. All right, and we're gonna try to cycle through here to the high setting, and we'll see what the generator does. Let's go to the manual cool high and see what happens. Hold it up. My hand's getting tired. Keep holding it. All right. Let's move this down to 70. 70. So far it seems to be, seems to be running just fine. to show it running so this is a Coleman I think it's a Mach 4 15,000 BTUs running perfect no issues I wanted to add that we're running the air conditioning unit without a soft start a lot of people install them to make the, the 2200 uh, start the AC unit a little easier this one is completely stock and just from our experience hasn't required the soft start Okay, so the temperature is continuing to come down. Generator's holding steady. No issues, we're at about 80 degrees. And we started around 83. So everything's, everything's working as it should. And, and we've, we've used this, um, like I said, many times boondocking. Um, and one disadvantage would be is that uh, the run time. So you have to um, put fuel in it, maybe partway through the night or it might run out. 
but overall very pleased one thing that i really like about the generator is just uh, how small it is and it's easy to throw in the back of the truck so compact and it's a little bit right now it's a little bit loud because it's running it's running the air conditioning unit so um, but overall for for just the, the power that you get in a smaller package I think it's a really really solid choice and would definitely recommend someone with this camper or a similar air conditioning unit to get the 2200i thanks for watching guys if you have any questions about the generator or the camper feel free to leave me a comment below thanks